Are you a service business owner trying to choose between Jobber and Booking Koala for managing your operations? You are in the right place because in this video, I'll dive into the features, pros and cons of each platform to help you decide which one is the best fit for your business. First, let's start with a brief introduction to both platforms. Jobber is a comprehensive business management software designed for service based businesses. It offers tools for scheduling, invoicing, client management, and more, aiming to streamline your operations and improve efficiency. Now, Booking Koala, on the other hand, is a booking and scheduling software focused on helping service providers manage their appointments and bookings. It also offers tools for marketing, customer management, financial tracking, making it a versatile choice for small to medium sized businesses. Now let's delve into the pros and cons of each platform, starting with Jobber. Now the biggest pros is the user-friendly interface. Jobber's interface is intuitive and easy to navigate, which reduces the learning curve for new users. They also have comprehensive features, wide range of them, including scheduling, dispatching invoicing, client management, and GPS tracking. This makes it a one-stop shop for managing your business operations. They also have a mobile app. Their mobile app allows you to manage your businesses on the go, ensuring you stay connected with your team and clients at all times. Also, their customer support is great. They provide excellent customer support with various resources like webinars, tutorials, and a responsive support team to help you with any issue. However, they do have their drawbacks as well and mainly the cost. Jobber can be relatively expensive, especially for small businesses or startup. The pricing plans might be a bit steep compared to other options. And also, while the comprehensive features are a plus, they can also make the platform feel a bit overwhelming, especially for new users who might only need basic functionalities. Now to booking quals. And their biggest con, in my opinion, is affordability. They offer competitive pricing plans, making it a cost-effective solution for small and medium-sized businesses. And also their marketing tools. In addition to booking and scheduling, Booking Koala provides robust marketing tools to help you attract and retain clients, including email marketing and promotions. Also, they have customizable booking forms. They allow you to create customizable booking forms, giving you flexibility in how you collect information from clients. And lastly, their automation options. They offer automation features that can help you streamline repetitive tasks, saving you time and reducing manual effort. Now for Booking Koala's drawbacks. They have limited advanced features. Now, while they do cover the basics pretty well, they lack some of the advanced features found in more comprehensive platforms like Jobber. Also, the user interface, it's less intuitive compared to other platforms, which might require a bit more time to get used to. And finally, their customer support. While they do offer customer support, some users have reported slower responses time and less comprehensive support resources compared to Jobber. So, in the end here, which one should you choose? If you are a small to medium sized business looking for an affordable user friendly platform with strong marketing tools, Booking Koala might be the right choice for you. Its customizable booking forms and automation features can help streamline your operations without breaking the bank. On the other hand, if you are looking for a more comprehensive solution with advanced features and are willing to invest a bit more, Jobber could be the better fit. Its robust set of tools, excellent customer support, and mobile app makes it a powerful option for managing all aspects of your service business. Now, ultimately, they both are great platforms. The choice depends on your specific needs, budget, and scale of your operation. Consider what features are most important to you and how much you are willing to invest in a platform to find the best fit for your business. Now, you cannot go wrong with any of them. They both are great in their own respective. However, it all comes down to your needs and priorities. Just make sure you go to each of the platform's website, take a look at the pricing, at the website's interface, at the plans they have, the services that they offer, 
and this will be a great factor in order to better determining which one is best for you so based on the pricing the services that they offer and of course as i told you your priorities and needs the decision will be clear 